What's up guys, Anka Spangin here, and today we are playing as Irelia in the mid lane in ranked PBE. Now I know you hear that and you're like, what the hell, whatever, man. But no, hear me out. Ranked on the PBE has been an adventure. Because the players, oh my lord. Like, you see these players... And you understand why Riot's adding a division that's lower than Bronze. It's fantastic. It's actually so much fun. It's hilarious. So these games are actually a great amount of fun. They're very troll. And we're going to see if we can climb on the PvE. Just have a good time. Because it's the first time I've actually laughed so hard at just being so baffled by everything. So we are against a LeBlanc today. And this... This is going to be one of those lanes that kind of sucks for a very short amount of time. And then it should be totally fine. <clears throat> but for that short amount of time, it's going to suck like a lot. But let's see if I can get her with this. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, God, I ran to the tower. Oh, man. Whatever. So this isn't the real one, but I still want to kill it because you get gold for it. But we did get her passive off already. That's actually really good. And with Corrupting Potion taking me back up, we got this. Oh, and boom, boom. First blood, just like that. Easy peasy. And she does have the teleport, so she'll just teleport right back to the lane. But getting that first blood, super nice. We like that. The early all-in from level 2 Irelia. Now, I do need to be careful of the Lee Sin. I do have Flash, but you know, it doesn't mean I shouldn't be careful still. So let's see. I thought she was going to try and go for more off of that, but I was wrong. I was very wrong. Uh, I should back, but... Uh, fudge, I missed it. But I really want to stay for just a bit more. No, don't do it. Don't do it. You know better. You know better. And we know how well we're going to have to play to win this game anyways. And it, it begins. Excellent. So to put in perspective... Just how fantastic the last two games have been. Uh, I was playing Ramus top, just having a fantastic time. And if you guys do want to see this game uploaded, I actually recorded the second one, and I was considering uploading it. But I'm not sure if I will just yet. Uh, and I ended like 8-5, and five, but the score of the game was like 20 to like 60. So, it was... It was spicy. It was a spicy meme ball, dude. The entire game was a meme. But we'll see how this goes. She is level 4 and she's got a pretty fat minion wave there. This <laughs> At least he got the shutdown. So I'm not actually going to queue onto these minions right here to get them. Because uh, that's actually just going to spell a lot of damage for me from LeBlanc. So we'll wait for this to get into the tower. Then we can start going on a queue rampage. Q, Q, Q. Now we can do the same thing to these. And whoop. And oh, I got her. Nice. And we jumped over the chain. Let's go, dude. Let's go, dude. And whoop, boom. Sniper with that W straight on the flash prediction. So that is another kill going down. Beautifully done, dude. And all because we landed the E on her. Irelia is all about landing that E, dude. All about it. Oh, I'm coming. I'm on my way. So let's see if we can get this guy. Here we go, and... Whoop! Oh, no! I missed, but he threw down two wards. Okay. All right, good try. Good try, though. So this is actually a really dangerous place for him to recall because we know he warded right there. All right, fortunately, Lee Sin just went top, though. So hopefully Nunu and Willump is okay. I might actually just be like, yo, let me swap with you <laughs> here in just a second. <laughs> because he cannot handle that Yasuo. Or they? I guess they, because it's Nunu and Willump. So. Dude, our Echo has 3 CS. Our Echo 80 carry has 3 CS. What? What? Oh, no. Oh, baby. This is the kind of game we expect. Give it to me. This is what... Oh, man. 
Well, ain't this just great? Woo. And I should be out of there. Yep. So give me that killing spree. Easy peasy. And I actually like to ignite LeBlanc's before the um before their passive goes off because that's actually a surefire way to identify which leblanc is the real one because the real one's gonna be burning <laughs> so if you guys don't know about that it is a very useful thing to know but get that stun on the lease in run out easy peasy and this actually might be a kill for him nope never mind lots of damage though for sure and he could actually follow this up with an invade because he knows either Lee Sin is backing or is going to be doing camps at really low health. The only issue is he doesn't know where Yasuo is. And LeBlanc is now right there. Well, now with these bits of information on the map, they're in a good spot. Nice. Not oh, dude, if I just landed that. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, we'll still get that kill just in time for Jax to still get the assist. So, nailed it. Because we know her distortion's not back up by then. Easy peasy. And Q, make sure we get that. And I don't really care if I take a tower shot here. I mean, obviously it's much more ideal if I don't. <laughs> but it's not really a big deal if I do. But let's see if I can get up here and help him out. So I don't have Ignite for this, but I will ping the on my way. I can also throw my Control Ward in the bush here while I'm down here doing that. Don't get too aggressive now, you hear, Sonny? Oh, oh, use your ult! It gives you a shield! Oh my god. I don't think he knows that his ultimate gave him a shield there. Bummer. Bummer, bummer. So he needed to ult a long time ago and get that shield off of it. And I also needed to dodge the tornado. I was hoping I could get the stun off on him before he was able to get his last breath off on me. So misplay on my end. Stops me from getting the kill. And I didn't want to pursue it because I don't think I can do it. Echo, how is your co? Okay. I have questions. <laughs> <laughs> I have questions regarding what that even means, but you know those are probably best saved for another time. So I don't know where Lee Sin is, me, and I don't want to go too hard. My ultimate's almost back up. There he is. Whoop! Get that stun. Avoid the Q. Avoid the chain. Avoid the second chain, and we're out of there. <laughs> Good stuff. Hit me with it. Come on, baby, do it. Do it. I've got my ult up now, and I've got two levels on this guy. So if he actually wants to fight me, I'm down. I'm down. You want to scrap? You want to do it? My ignite's up in 10 seconds. I should be able to fight both of them. Especially if I play it well. Boop. All right. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Where are you flashing to, son? Where are you flashing to? Uh, dude, that... That LeBlanc flash, though, what? Uh, I could have actually gone for that. Oh, you hate to see it. You really do. But, we'll still get that kill. Easy peasy. It's all Gucci, baby. Let's see if we can carry this. All right, Yasuo is in my face. He's going to try and get on me, but we're just going to avoid this and flash here. Oh, whoops. Whoops. So I needed to flash before his Q hit me. Like, the Q that gave him this tornado was my big mistake there. I didn't flash before that point, and that's my fault. I need to swap with me. I can handle Yasuo. Oh no. Nunu's dead. Alright, so we have to be the ones to handle Yasuo here. 
Because Yasuo is getting out of hand. And Nunu should be able to lane against the LeBlanc okay. Like, I don't think he'll be killing the LeBlanc. But he'll be able to lane against her. And that's the important part. Oh my god, look at this experience lead that Yasuo gets, man. Rough. Alright, let's see if we can fight him, though. With my ultimate, I think I should be good, too. But it's going to definitely be a challenge. So that's not going to reach him. So I just need to make sure my ult doesn't get windwalled and we're good. There we go. Oh, damn it. He didn't do it. Alright, there goes that. And let's see. Without wind wall, I maybe got this. Got him. Easy! Thanks for that red buff back, bitch! Cool. <sighs> Dude, this is gonna be a tough one. This is gonna be a toughie. We got this, though. I believe. And also, the reason we're playing Irelia is because it gives me an excuse to show off her amazing new skin. Like, this skin is actually so good. It's so cool. Divine Sword Irelia, if you guys don't know what it's called. And we'll utilize our Sheen here. Just throw the E and then throw it again after the Sheen proc has been consumed. I don't know if I can get this turret, but yeah, I can't get it. But I can certainly get some good damage off on it. And now I can get my Trinity Force and double long swords. And in this game, definitely just going to get Ninja Tab Eye. No doubt about it. Ooh. He tried, went for the juke. Will die, though, unfortunately, I'm sure. Good try, buddy. Nice try, buddy. So. I need to keep handling this Yasuo, though. It's not particularly up to me. He's a monster. He's a menace. He's a disgusting champion right now. And we have to be the ones to handle it. We will take this upon ourselves. So, Once my ult's back up, we can fight him again. Just like I said, be sure not to launch it into the wind wall and we are good. As long as I can cover that, everything's totally, totally fine. Cool. With the Trinity Force Power Spike and my Ignite, that was all she wrote. Yasuo doesn't have a lot of chance against me right now if I uh, if I play well. <laughs> if I don't play well, he'll slaughter me because he'll do a lot more damage than I will just through auto attacking. But if I do play well, he does not stand a chance against me. So, we can put this puppy on a leash call him tamed so we're gonna work towards this titanic hydra here and after i get that we'll be way better off as far as wave clear and all in potential nice so this red buff is up and i see lee sim bottom so i really want to take this <laughs> i really want to take this captain monk always trying to be the voice of reason too you gotta love that man you gotta love him I want to wait for him to use that tornado. Ooh. Let's see. Can I get this? Fuck, I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Maybe? Hup. Fuck. Ah, and that's exactly what I mean, guys. If I don't play it well, I lose so hard. Like, if I don't play it well, it's over for me. So, good job on Yasuo. I didn't know he had this warded, so I didn't know he could see me. Either that, or I just ran up into a bad spot, and the minions from here were able to get the vision on me. Either way, I didn't think he knew I was there. I was trying to wait for him to launch that tornado forward, and then go in on him. But, it looks like my plans were thwarted. And he got that red buff back. And now I want it back, too. But we'll see how it goes. Ninja Tab by anti mac complete. Way better off, but no ultimate now because I did use it in my attempted escape. And I also just gave Yasuo a fat shutdown, dude. That's 
not good for me. I'm on my way. Fuck. That's actually so not good. Maybe? It's fine. Everything's fine. Triumph wins. I'm the best. All right. Whew. I was really hoping to get him uh, while he was still in his ultimate animation with my E, which is why I flashed there. But... Nice ward. Nice ward. But it still worked out for us. Still worked out real well. And by real well, I mean we killed Yasuo. What is this guy doing? Do you think he can fight me? Come on, cue on to me. Do it. Come on, brother. I dare you. I dare you. Okay. <laughs> he ain't doing it. And I'm not going to take this. Uh, I'm just beating it up for him. Take, 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 take. I was just helping you. Because I love you. I don't want to have all the power funneled onto just me alone. That is a unwise choice. So if I can get a big Jax, this game will be much easier for us to win. Let's see. Oh, dude, if I can get here in time, this will be so good. I should have been here. I should have been paying attention. Alright, this can still be really good. This can still be really good. Oh, I'm coming. Oh, I'm coming. Boom. And boom. Boom. Come on. Come on, boom! That's the triple that we wanted. And we can get the Infernal off of that, too. Oh. Whew. We got this, boys! We will carry this! Get drag, I got Yas. Okay, tell them I got the Yasuo. <laughs> Dude, he's actually AFK, holy moly. Okay. So with Zoe's help, this shouldn't be too tough. Drop the E right there. Throw this. Drop that. Okay. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. That Infernal is going to help so much. And it looks like... Oh, we got a Cloud Dragon next. The Vape Drake is next on the menu. So let's back it up. Get Titanic. And... What should I get? I should probably just get a lot more damage, but I also think I should get some... If I get a Randuin's right now, I will be so unstoppable. We can go more damage after the Randuin's, but right now, being able to stop so much damage from the three main damage dealers is going to be imperative for us. Especially because we're essentially playing a 4v6. Because Echo's... He's actually, like, on the other team. Let's see if I can get here. Oh, I missed! Oh, no! Oh, thank you, my man! Please! Please! Got him? Alright, Triumph is good. Oh, thank God for that. You wouldn't think you'd be thanking your lucky stars for an enemy. But I launched my ultimate directly into Yasuo's wind wall. If Thresh hadn't flashed where he did, that would have been consumed by the wind wall, and that fight would have been a disaster. An absolute disaster. So, alright, there's nothing I can push with, and Lee Sin is looking for our Zoe. So I'm actually going to run bottom. This will get me enough money after I clear it to grab my Randuins. So, I will be going for this. Lee Sin is up on the top side of our jungle, so this is actually a pretty free steal if I choose to go for it. But this wave is way more important. And, like I said, I need to funnel resources onto myself and Jax. So, at this point, pretty much no one else is important. Nunu, like, this isn't against Nunu or Zoe. They are going to be useful. But funneling gold onto them isn't optimal in this situation. Because I'm already so far ahead and Zoe was set behind because she had to play like a support. I think this could be really good. So boop, boop. And we got the godlike. My E is up in one second. And he just dashed forward. That's a snare. Boop, boop. And boop. Nice. Good stuff. Alright, Randuin's is in the hand as soon as I go back next. 
I will I will stop Yas again. You guys all push. So as long as I match Yasuo, we're fine. I don't actually need to match him. I just need to make sure he doesn't collapse onto my team. Okay, it looks like he probably backed. Diving. Yeah, there it is. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm on my way. And maybe? What? That's actually so bad. That's actually so bad. <sighs> I really don't like that about Yasuo, but I do understand how it works. If you guys didn't see it, what he did was he windwalled the other way. Yeah, diving was not good when we saw Yasuo was gone from top. So, but like I was trying to explain what happened there was Yasuo launched his wind wall as my ultimate was colliding with him. And if you guys don't know this, Yasuo's wind wall begins this collision the split second he casts it. And it will launch out of his body. So if you are right on time, you will negate any skill shot, regardless of how close it is to you, if you get that wind wall off before it registers as a hit. So... That makes it a very dangerous ability, and very annoying, and I really hope Echo doesn't plan on taking this blue. Alright, Chrono Break is going to be some damage. This is good for us. And the boom. Alright, give me that. Let's see if we can go for more. Do it. Take it. Come on. So I just need to run them down right now. I am a big boy. Alright. And I think our Jax should be able to 1v1? Maybe? It looks like he's not going to try. I think if he plays it well, he can 1v1 him. So I know this is warded, but like I don't really care. <laughs> like, I really don't care at all. Let's see. Alright. Potential chrono break. There's the wind wall. I'm actually really glad Echo's at least attempting to do stuff. Because that's better than him just being AFK. Unroot me! Oh my god, dude. Echo, I thought you were with us, baby. Oh no. Fuck, man. What do I need? What do I have to do here? I have to kill Yasuo. That's all I have to do. But how do I do it? Because it's getting to the point that... It, don't, it doesn't even matter how well I play it. Yasuo is just too strong. So how do I do this? How do I go about doing it? What do I need? Do I, I don't think armor is the choice here. I think I sell this. Because even though Guardian Angel is a good item, I obviously don't sell it yet. Because I still need as much items as I can get. But, oh my god. Alright, that's one. This is good. This is good. I think I'm going to need a Mortal Reminder. I really need to cut his healing. And then, once Jax gets Titanic, we'll be in a better spot. I think I can do this, right? Nice. Good job, Zoe. Super, super important catch there. I don't think the Drake is the option here, though. Like, we've got two of them down. Like, it will... I guess it's nice to get it. But I don't think it's the option we want here. I'll we'll let her do the bursting. I guess it does help us prep for later in the game at least. So we can look at it that way. So we can certainly look at it that way. I can't afford the Guardian Angel now too. So if we... Oh! Ooh! 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 
Fuck. Fuck. Oh, wait. Hidden wind wall. Oh my god, are you serious? Right? Unhook me! Yes! Yes! Whew. We can push off of that. We can push off of that. We have to push off of that. We absolutely have to push off of that. We have to get this inhib. And it doesn't really matter if we get the kill off on Lucian, because he's not gonna he's not gonna stop us from taking this. There's no way. Okay. Back up, back up. We got the inhibitor. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Those are the next objectives that are gonna be coming up. Top lane. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> but that's not a big deal. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, Echo's actively trolling. <laughs> this is what we live for, man. Okay, so we got this. We can sell this for Mortal Reminder. Perfect. I do so much damage now. Wait, he's actively trying to stop us from winning the game. He's, like, actively trying to stop us from winning the game. You gotta love it, man. You gotta love it. Give me that red. Thank you for the leash, Echo. I appreciate you trying to help. We need to pick a fight right here. Nice. Nice. Whew. We can push off of that. We don't have a big wave to work with, but that was exactly what needed to happen. Alright, as long as we don't get 1v5'd by Yasuo, we're good. That's super good. His wind wall being down is amazing. All I need to do is not get hit myself. Nice, drowsy. Dude, he is dead. You are dead, brother. Oh, yes. Yes, dude. Oh, I didn't get the stun, but it's okay. That's the kill. And use this. Root it up. Nice. Fuck, we don't have a wave. All right, the wave is coming in. We can win while Yasuo is dead. Jax killed himself. We win. We did it. Nice, guys. Fucking nice. Hell yes. Woo! The 4v6 carry. I cannot believe that Echo just said GG easy. I would actually staple your nuts to the wall if I could right now. <laughs> God damn it. What a game, man. What a game. And that, my friends, that is what it means to play ranked on the PBE. Whew. Finally, the first win on a beautiful skin nonetheless. Zoe coming in huge at very important times that game. And this damage chart. Oof. The two titans stand atop their thrones with Zoe. My right-hand man right there with me. But that was a game. And don't let Silver fucking 5 deceive you. You guys saw the game. You guys saw it. This is the PvE, man. 25, 4, and 5 on the end. We got the S+. Plus. And let me actually show you guys the other two games. I wasn't joking. I really want to show these to you guys. So you would look at my games and be like, oh, he was Ramus with Ignite. He's trolling. 11, 5, and 3, 8, 5, and 2. Trolling. But the first game, 116, 6, 297, 114, 9, 5, 14, 2, with everyone across the board flaming each other. Captain Monk wasn't flaming. He was just, he was receiving a lot of flame because the teammates were angry. Next game, it wasn't too much different than the first. I went 8, 5, and 2. But then we had 112 and 4, 315 and 9, and 212 and 2 on the Yorick. 
And don't let the Azir's almost okay score deceive you. He actually stopped dying just because he AFK'd. So, I am not convinced that I'm not already playing. I'm not already playtesting the division below bronze. You couldn't convince me otherwise. But, regardless, a great game. And if you guys did enjoy this video, do leave a like and a comment. Everybody does love the comeback story. And if you want to, you can subscribe, ring that bell to be notified whenever I do upload a video. And as always, I love you guys and I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace!